Hello everyone, how are you? Three minutes today uh, on the Gospel of Mark. We're reading from Mark chapter 3, verse 7 to 12. And this is day 10. Day 10. Yay. We're going to read and we're going to quickly journal. Three minutes. Here we go. Verse 7. Mark 3, 7. Jesus withdrew with his disciples to the lake. And a large crowd from Galilee followed. When they heard all he was doing, many people came to him from Judea, Jerusalem, Idumea, and the regions across the Jordan and around Tyre and Sidon. Because of the crowd, he told his disciples to have a small boat ready for him to, to keep the people from crowding him. For he had healed many so that those with diseases were pushing forward to touch him. And whenever the evil spirits saw him, they fell down before him, cried out, You are the Son of God. But he gave them strict orders not to tell who he was. And Jesus went up on the mountainside and called to him those he wanted. And they came to him. He appointed them 12, designated them apostles, that they might be with him and that he might send them out to preach and that he might to have authority to drive out demons. These are the 12 he appointed. Simon, to whom he gave the name Peter, James, the son of Zebedee, and his brother John. To them he gave the name Boanoges, which means sons of thunder. Andrew, Philip, Bartholomew, Matthew, Thomas, James, son of Alphaeus, Thaddeus, Simon the Zealot, and Judas Iscariot, who betrayed him. Okay, here's my thinking on this. Jesus' work was so busy, there was so many in need that Jesus wanted to appoint 12 others. There is reproduction in the kingdom, and I'm one and you're one. And my prayer is that God's authority would come on us, that we might pray for the sick, we might share the gospel with his love and power. Are you ready? I want to pray that there's a supernatural multiplication in our lives. Lord, I pray that just like you appointed the 12, you would appoint me and others, all, all these others listening today, that you'd increase the, the power of the Holy Spirit in our life, that we would pray for people. We would see people healed in Jesus' name, set free, in Jesus' name. I pray for the multiplication today in Jesus' name. Amen. And my journal would be multiply in us. Multiply in us today. Me and you multiply the work of the ministry. Multiply in us. Well, that's day 10. Have an amazing day in Jesus' name.